All right, we did print in the uh, last video, so I'm just going to do a little bit of practice in print. I'm already in uh, online Swift Playground because I'm on Windows, and this is automatically loaded. So if I run it, it'll print Hello World. Not really interested in that. We just want to print some cool patterns. So we'll go over the uh, P pattern. So double space P. Oh, sorry. No, not double space P. The first P has to be uh, singular because we want to make a cool little pattern. Double space P here. La -da -da. And triple space, sorry, quadruple space P here. And then we go back to a double space P. And the last P shall be printed as a no space P. And this is just so we can print out a cool pattern. I'm actually going to print out here before that pattern a space. Um, just because I want a new line to start. There we are. So we have our design outside of that. Okay, I'm happy with that. That's worked. What else can I make? Um, well, I'll print another space just so that absolutely nothing is printed. So we've got space between our two patterns. And oh, I nearly did that there in capitals. So I'm actually going to print an X now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to print two X's in the same uh, statement. So I'll have the first X, have one, two, three spaces okay i'll print the second x i don't know how this is going to come out and i'll just put it two spaces in so it should be in the middle of uh, both of those x's there and i'll print the last x the same as the first so one x one two three spaces and an x you know what i'm actually going to change that three spaces to four spaces because i think it's going to be better spacing and i'm just going to print that out there and that X, we don't need it. So I'm just going to redo that. And you can see here we have, you know, an X uh, with an X kind of thing. You see what I'm saying there? So we've got two X's here, one X in the middle. And this overarching uh, shape is actually in itself an X. That's all I really want you to do to practice. I mean, now nah, we'll... We'll print, we'll print a couple of numbers, we'll print 900, uh, we'll print 55, and we'll print 87, okay. Let's have a quick look, and that confirms that they work. Now I'm going to use this next print statement, and I'm going to print zero, but notice that I've got an opening parenthesis, i.e. this symbol, but no closing parenthesis. And this should come up with an error now. To get rid of this error, I'm going to do uh, what's known as a comment. I think comments are started in Swift like this. This essentially means the things that follow um, won't get read by the program. But I'll, I'll get into that more later on, just so that that doesn't print. And now it's working. So this just nulls whatever comes after it. And then I'm going to use print with a capital letter and I'm going to print 102 and it won't work because print is in capital and the print statement is supposed to be in lowercase with a lowercase p. And you can see that hasn't worked. And then if I get rid of it with a comment like this, it will work. So these two prints here are incorrect as uh, I've laid out. Anyway, that's pretty much it for the practice. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it.